Hello, this is Mike Major, and uh, today we're going to try to demonstrate how we start getting control of our horse's shoulders and our control of our horse's back end so that we can convert that into a side pass on our horses. Um, so here we'll start off with uh, demonstrating how uh, I want to trot this little horse in a circle here. Now I'm going to ask this horse to move that shoulder out with my right leg here. I should move that shoulder out of that circle. Now I'm going to ask him to come back into that circle with my left leg. Now I'm going to ask this horse to move that shoulder back out with my right leg. And so here I'm just trying to get control of this horse's shoulders so that when, if you get a hold, control of the front end of the horse and the back end of the horse, you'll have control of the middle of the horse to do your side passes, but you need to have control of that front end on that horse. Here we're going to turn him the other direction, move that shoulder off to the right with our left leg. Okay, now we're going to go to the fence here and uh, do some little exercises that I do uh, on moving this horse's back end. I'm going to ride this horse down the fence to help keep his shoulder in place. I'm going to hold that shoulder up and I'm going to ask that horse to give his back, uh, to move that back in in position three with my leg in position three. There he's moving his, his hip good and we're still walking forward and move that hip with my leg in position three. And we're going to go back the other direction. Now I want to pick up the sh that right shoulder on this horse and I'm going to ask that horse to move his hip over for me. But I want to keep that shoulder picked up so that he doesn't drop that shoulder into the way that his hip is moving. Here it is to the right. But uh, we'll take this horse back the other direction. Now I'm going to pick up that left bridle rein, pick up that shoulder, move that hip over to the left. I'm going to ask him to move that hip over again to the left. I'm going to have my foot in position three. I'm going to have my left leg in position one to help hold that shoulder up. Now we'll bring this horse in. This is just a colt, just a young horse that uh, we don't have a lot of saddles on. But now we're going to side pass this colt a little bit and I just want to stop him from going forward and asking him to move to his left with my leg in position two. Now we've taught this horse how to move his shoulders with our legs in position one, taught him how to move his hip with our leg in position three, and when we put our leg in between the two into position two, this horse ought to just move laterally for us. And that's, we're stopping forward motion, asking that horse just to step over. And so we're no more rides in this colt's hat, he's doing awful well. He's, uh, he's taking it good because he understands how to move his shoulders and how to move his hips. And we've taught him to that independently. And now we're trying to put the two together here and get us a side pass. So we're just asking him to move over. If you'll notice, my weight is always to the outside.